Ruiz. Caught on camera, here's a live view from our sky cam of the full moon rising. This is the full sturgeon moon and it is a super moon. You can see it, it is bright in the sky. A couple of clouds out there, but it shouldn't obstruct your view. But if you have to go to bed and you miss out, don't worry, there's another super moon you can view. Our next full moon, which will be the blue moon at the end of August. And the super moon, it appears slightly larger and 10% brighter. So it really is a treat to see in the sky. Now, overnight temperatures will be in the 70s and 80s, likely not going to cool much, especially here in Baton Rouge. That ridge of high pressure just going to dominate our weather pattern, at least for the next couple of days. And areas shaded in that dark red have the greatest chance for temperatures above normal 10 to 20 degrees above uh, normal. So we are expecting record heat here. Once again, you can see upper 90s, lower 100s area wide with roughly a 40% chance for rain, but the rain may arrive later in the afternoon, which would come after we would warm up to about 101, give or take a couple of degrees. The feels like temperature tomorrow, but uh, about 109 all the way up to 115 in Gonzales. So we are expecting another heat morning in place could have one all the way through the weekend as well. That's between 10 a.m. and 7 p.m. tomorrow. And so that means there's a pretty high risk for heat related illnesses if you don't take proper precautions. Thursday, pretty similar upper 90s, lower 100s, likely going to have another heat morning in place. But once again, we have that chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms developing in the afternoon, evening. A lot of you going to miss out completely. And and some of you could get a nice batch of rain moving into the afternoon, cool you off, and then they would fade by the afternoon hours or the uh, late afternoon, early evening hours. There is a slightly lower chance for rain on Thursday, which means our temperatures would be going up once again to about 102 degrees. Same for Friday, Saturday, 101. Sunday, hot with pop-up thunderstorms, feels like temperatures are going to be up to 115. And that's going to be the case into next week week as well, even as this ridge pushes to the west. Next seven days, our rain totals a tenth of an inch, maybe up to an inch for some hot spots. But with the lack of rain, this is really concerning, in fact. So wildfires increasingly likely as hotter and drier than normal uh, weather pattern continues. This is for the month of August. This is the potential and outlook that was issued by the National Interagency Coordination Center. So that's going to be something we're going to have to watch very carefully this month and hope that we can cool down and get some meaningful rain. But in the meantime, the next seven days pop up thunderstorms as we know daily with record high temperatures, dangerous heat. I'm so ready for fall. I'm counting down, but what